call garden crisis jeremiah chapter 33 and verse 3 ask me and i will tell you remarkable secrets you do not know about things to come crisis is a time when difficult or important decisions must be made this text is an imperative statement of jeremiah as a prophecy from god to the people of israel he affirmed that god wanted them to call him during their crisis The promise from God is such that when they call him during crisis he would do remarkable things that would be a surprise to them this is God's unconditional love for his people despite the fact they pledged allegiance to other pagan gods crisis is part of our life it knocks us down at an unexpected time it leaves us with the inability to make the right decision during crisis we go to people and other sources for support and help but it often fails and we lose out we try god as the last resort when everything is messed up nevertheless our god so phenomenally loves that he would still resolve our issues readers digest june 1992 featured an article called rules for crisis management it goes this way number 1 hope for the best but prepare for the worst number 2 look first then act number 3 When you do act, act aggressively. Number four, seek help. Number five, don't get locked on a detail. Number six, no matter how bad things get, be truthful. Number seven, look for the silver lining. I have added the final one to this list of seven rules, which should be the first one. Look for God's purpose in the crisis and be assured that he can help you out of it If you call on him in your crisis call God in crisis God bless you